in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen the gospel of luke chapter 17 verses 5 and 6 the apostles said to the lord increase our faith the lord replied if you had faith the size of a mustard seed you could say to this mulberry tree be uprooted and planted in the sea and it would obey you in the last part we were praying lord increase our faith increase our faith so if you wanted to do the healing ministry if you wanted to heal yourself if you wanted to do healing for others the first step i told you pray that faith of jesus come the faith operating in the life of jesus comes upon me and receive that faith in the anointing of the holy spirit it is a supernatural gift it is a free gift god has to give to us and claim and confess lord increase my faith now i told i am telling in this class once faith comes we take power power and authority the power and authority of the word of god we have to take when the anointing comes when the spirit comes we receive that in the in the anointing of the holy spirit we take the authority of faith that we are praying and praying once the authority power comes with the authority of god we have to cast out the spirit of diseases whatever the challenges we are facing we have to cast out one side we cast out the spirit of sickness cast out the spirit of anger we cast out the spirit of all kind of bondages we break we cast out any kind of financial problem we cast out any challenges we are there we have to cast out with the authority of jesus with the authority of jesus we cast out then when the authority of jesus we cast out what happens it is in jesus name we are casting out we claim the authority and the power is released the word of god says you can remove uproot whatever it is standing at least like a mustard seed that faith comes you are able to do the miracle healing and wonders healing and wonders with the authority of jesus authority of jesus this is the second point in the healing ministry and by praying and praying maybe you can go into the blessed sacrament or in your own personal room if you are doing a healing ministry and if you are praying for your your own healing you sit in front of the lord and jesus was praying the whole night and sitting with the father in front of the father and to receive the power and authority and that power and authority is when we receive it we receive it we can demonstrate it i remember once i went for the sacrament of confession even though it is a matter of confession it is how i enriched it my spiritual guide who was guiding me in the confession he asked me to recite one lakh time to invoke 
the divine charism the charism of the holy spirit the gift of healing he asked me to invoke one lakh time and sitting in front of the lord and days and days i remember once that after i completing this prayer one lady was going to the hospital cancer treatment she was in full tears and i did the prayer of deliverance i did the prayer with authority it is in the name of jesus i cast out i bind i cast out the spirit of cancer the spirit of cancer i bind it and whatever we confess with the power and authority and the bible is telling when the anointing of the holy spirit come if you pray together whatever you are binding it is bound whatever you are releasing it is released so when did the prayer of the deliverance prayer and the lady later came to me with the tears when he was she was going to begin her treatment when the test done again and there is no germs of cancer in her body so that is why you can use it the power and authority when you do the healing power healing ministry and when you pray for the healing we need by praying and praying maybe hours and hours and months and months you pray for the anointing receive the power receive the authority and claim the healing of the gift of specially the gift of healing you can pray for all the charism specially all the fruits gifts and charism and you empower yourself that is the second point i wanted to tell the first increase the faith and second you have to be and you be you have to be strengthened by strengthened by the power and authority so to receive that power and authority you receive every day saint paul is telling to timothy every day you rekindle with the fire of the holy spirit and invoke every day invoke the spirit of healing spirit of healing especially spirit of healing and spirit gift of the all the charism of the holy spirit and again you have to open your mouth open your mouth you confess with a full courage with a full confidence not with a fear fear or a doubt with a full confidence you have to confess cast out open your mouth and confess the word of god any not only for sickness maybe any kind of challenges any kind of blocks it is there it is there you have to do it i remember once in the online retreat time one lady said some kind of relationship problem with a life partner and with the power and authority started to pray i told her told her you just say i cut and break i cut i cut and break she did with the power and authority that is why that is the miracle when we say jesus says it is in the we can mark 11 22 23 we can cast out we can change the mountain change the mountain with authority when she did the prayer of breaking the the relationship breaking the life partner is having and it is broken it is broken we cast out the diseases any kind of challenges maybe sometime we see in the olden days the priest and any kind of the insects coming in the field paddy field and all they do the prayer of the deliverance and cast out all the insects it is god we see in the old testament elijah and elisha they manifesting the power and authority again with the even the the nature even the nature were obedient sometime i have seen 
the people used to some any program it is going on with the power and authority they are stopping the even the rain so what i was telling it is not to show for anything it is a saving the life of the people it is to show of your uh, your spiritual powers nothing you pray you pray with the, to the holy spirit in faith and anoint yourself with the power all the fruits of the holy spirit and demonstrate god's power to heal the people we cast out with the power and authority the germs of diseases amen demonstrate the power and authority that is the second part of the healing you take care in your life amen